welcome back to another video if you're new here my name is Kaylee today is Monday May 2nd we are in a new month new goals about to reset for the month I decided to film a little spring reset because I didn't get the chance to do it in April just because I was obviously traveling the whole entire month and that's why I've not been that active here on YouTube and don't get me wrong I love traveling and I feel so blessed to have the opportunity to be able to travel but at the same time I'm a very routine person so when I'm out of routine I'm just like not happy <laughs> so like the after like the third trip I was like okay I'm done like I've literally want to go home I want to see Freddie I want to see Zach I want to like get back into my routine start meal prepping eat home cooked meals like you don't realize how much you appreciate home cooked meals until you've eaten out like almost every single meal. So yeah, I just like made me realize how much I missed being home and how much I miss just like cooking my own meals, being in my own space. So yeah, so I thought it'd be fun to film a little spring reset. I guess more of like a new month reset because we're going into May. I cannot believe it's already May, April literally went by like that and we're getting so close to summer the weather here in Ottawa has been so nice today not so much but this past weekend it was beautiful I really enjoy filming content outside so I love going out for runs doing um, some of my workouts outside on my yoga mat so you'll definitely be seeing that more here on the channel but I started to film more outdoor videos for like my TikTok and reels so you guys will see that coming this week but yeah and I've also been taking Freddie for runs so Freddie went for his first run yesterday and he loved it I feel like he needs to find ways to burn energy just because he cockapoos they're known for like very energetic dogs and sometimes he just has a hard time burning his energy so running was something that I thought I would start to get in with him so we did I want to say almost a 5k run yesterday and he was dead like last night <laughs> Zach was like what did you do to this dog like he would not wake up like he was just sleeping the whole entire time so I decided to book a reform Pilates class so if you guys have been watching some of my other videos I recently got into Pilates and I like to do that at least once a week just because a I really like getting out of the house to do a workout it's just like a good feeling um so I really really like to attend some classes and it's just another way to like motivate yourself to get out of the house so a little tip if you guys want some motivation book a class because you basically have no choice but to go or else you lose your money so <laughs> there's some motivation if you guys need some to get out of the house to do a workout but I'm gonna do a Pilates class today I took the day off for my nine to five today um, well I actually didn't take it off I guess some news is is that I cut my hours down with my nine to five job so I'm actually only gonna be working uh, two days a week with my nine to five and then the rest content so I'm just really excited to like be able to have more time to do that just because I feel like it's Things have been getting really crazy busy and I just like need more time to edit videos film videos All that So yeah, anyways today's a really busy day. So that's why I kind of wanted to film because we like productive days So I just made myself a coffee I'm gonna finish up my coffee I then have to head to my parents' place to get some product that got dropped off from a brand to film content for, which I'll do today. Then I'm going to do my Pilates class. It's currently 10 a.m. I booked a later class just because Freddie, anyways, he has major separation anxiety and it's like to the point where like we need to go to the vet because he cannot be left alone right now for like not even an hour, which is like super sad. So we are going to see the vet in the coming weeks just to figure out like what we could do just to help with his anxiety so i'm gonna drop him off at my parents place go to my pilates class I typically like to do my classes in the morning but sometimes you just gotta do what you gotta do so yeah we'll do that later and then yeah maybe do some cleaning i have to do some grocery shopping as well so we'll do a little grocery haul also before i leave today i just also want to get into my planner and my journaling i try and do this every single morning just because i feel more organized especially with this planner this is super new it's by um knits she's a instagram influencer she started a business called mind your business and she launched this planner which is absolutely stunning and the inside is great 
So like if you have monthly goals, obviously we're going into a new month so we can write down your goals and reflections from the month. And then they just have like obviously the each day. So like Monday, Tuesday, and then they have little um, to-do lists, top three priorities, something I'm grateful for, today's schedule, highlight of the day. So yeah, I find this is really good, especially when I'm like trying to figure out content that I have to film, organizing my nine to five. Anyways, this has been really, really helpful. So I'm gonna do that just to write down everything that I have to get done for the day. I also find like writing stuff down helps me remember. And then obviously five minute journal, just like writing down my daily, daily affirmations. Things that I'm grateful for, coffee, candle, yeah. Just about to head out for the day, but I thought I would show you guys the outfit I'm wearing. I just recently got this sweat set from Sammy Clark's new brand called Join Form. It is absolutely stunning. I'm obsessed with this color and the material guys and the quality is just, yeah, really, really good. So I'm just wearing this and sorry guys, my camera is just not focusing right now. And then underneath, since I am heading to a Pilates class, I am wearing a new workout set from Set Active in this like blue, royal blue color. I'm wearing like the leggings and then this is what the bra looks like you'll have a better look of it when I uh, film it. Um, I'm gonna film obviously this outfit in my Pilates class so you guys will see like the whole fit once I take this off. Gym bag, it's from Aloe. And then just using my little Prada re-edition um, handbag. So yeah, just gonna head to my parents' place, get what I need to do for filming, and then get a workout in. Okay, I'm currently driving to my Pilates class. It's one of those days where it's just like, go, go, go. <laughs> so nothing wrong with those days, but sometimes it can be stressful. So anyways, just on my way to Pilates, gonna get that done, dropped Freddie off at my parents' place, grabbed what I had to grab for filming. I, yeah, my camera might slide off this dash because I'm obviously driving and I don't have a good tripod to set this camera up with. I am really excited to, get this Pilates class in because I have not been in a month since I've been traveling. So I'm really excited to get this really good workout in and then get some lunch because I haven't obviously eaten anything. It's currently 11.40, class is at noon. So I don't know what I'm gonna make for lunch yet, but it'll be something good. Okay, just got home from my Pilates class and the grocery store was right beside it, which is super convenient. So I was able to do grocery shopping right after, but I didn't get that much just because Zach did a big grocery run on yesterday, on Sunday. So I only had to pick up a few things, but I really need to like go through my fridge and just like clean it out. So we'll do that, but I do want to eat lunch first because I haven't eaten lunch and I'm starving. But I will do like a little grocery haul of what I got, just because these are like the staples that I buy every week. And like one of the main sources of like what is included in my daily meals that I have during the week. So first things first, this is not something you can get if you're not from Canada, but it's a brand called Farm Boy. And they have these, I can't even pronounce it, Fatuzzi chips. But the ingredients are super clean. It's literally just wheat flour, water, coconut oil, oil, sea salt, and yeast. And I just like to have these with hummus when like I want a snack. So I'll probably have these like while I'm making lunch because I'm that kind of person where I just like to snack and when I'm starving, I'm starving. So I will probably be eating that before 
I eat. Or you could also dip this with guac, like if you make some guacamole, so good. Then I love getting sourdough bread for making avocado and toast, whether it's for lunch or for breakfast, or just like peanut butter with banana, cinnamon, honey on top. But I get it done fresh at a local bakery here in Ottawa. Well, same place, Farm Boy. And yeah, I just love the way sourdough bread tastes. I highly recommend trying it yourself if you've never tried it, but it just tastes so fresh. That's the best way to describe it, I think. Then, if you guys haven't watched any of my recent videos, I recently changed up my milks. I decided to go with more cleaner ingredients just because I started to look into what some of the oils were doing for you, and I just like yeah, it wasn't good. I'll see if I can find where I found it. I think it was actually an influencer. Her name's Be Well with Kayla. She's actually a health coach. And she just like has some really informational things about your health and just products that you're buying on a daily basis, things like that. And again, I don't eat clean like 24 seven. Obviously I'm all about balance, but if I can find ways to swap for cleaner ingredients, I will. So this new milk I'm trying is called Al Almhurst, I believe is what the brand called. It's literally two ingredients, filtered water and almonds. And I'm not gonna lie guys, I've tried multiple like clean ingredient milks and some taste like absolute crap. Like I, I, I have to be honest, like I did do some trials of different types of milk from different places. And I did try two different ones before this one and I absolutely hated it. I forced myself to finish it because they're not cheap. Um, when you spend money on certain milks like this and I wasn't a fan of them and then I came across this brand and I actually really really like it and I also get their oat milk as well for my coffee they have like a barista edition so highly recommend this brand it's actually really really good and I know it's a little bit pricier but sometimes it's worth spending the extra two dollars to know that you're getting something cleaner that's just like my personal opinion like i'd rather pay that knowing that i'm getting something that's better for my body um but you could totally just do whatever works for you and if, and if you can drink dairy that's great i just can't <laughs> okay then i got a bunch of turkey products i love doing ground turkey or turkey bacon we get turkey sausages turkey <laughs> burgers just because it's a really good lean source of protein and i still like chicken but i don't like having it as often as i used to i think just because i'm getting sick and tired of the taste i don't know it's just me and chicken have not been getting along very well so i've decided to convert to turkey i've been going towards turkey more often than usual and i just really really like it to make any pasta dishes or some breakfast options turkey burgers with like sweet potato fries like putting in the air fryer yeah so these are just like really good alternatives if you're looking for a good lean protein i think for lunch i'm gonna do some turkey bacon with avocado and toast with honey you guys need to try avocado and toast with honey it is a game changer i think i tried it about two or three months ago and blew my mind like i was that kind of person where I was like, I would never put honey on avocado. Like that sounds disgusting. And it's literally so good. And I also put like everything bagel seasoning and red pepper flakes. I'll show you guys what it looks like at the end, but I've been having this like almost, almost every single day for lunch. Just cause it's quick, it's easy, it's good. And when something's good, you just gotta stick to it I find. So anyways, I'm gonna make that and I'll show you guys how it turns out. Just finished lunch not too long ago and then got caught up with a bunch of work. So the time just kind of flew by. So I'm now gonna clean out the fridge as I mentioned and just put the fresh stuff in and then just do a bit of a clean around the apartment. So yeah.
fridge is completely organized. Looks so much cleaner. I threw out all the bad food from last week, so it's just nice to have like a fresh, clean slate. We have way too many milks. <laughs> Me and my boyfriend like two different types of milks, so we have double the amount of milks, but yeah. That's the fridge. I'm now gonna make some dinner and prep some food for the week to have for lunches and then just kind of tidy up whatever else needs to be cleaned, but we love a clean fridge. Freddie got this toy and he's obsessed with it. So if you hear that squeaking in the background, that is why, it's because Freddie is chewing his new toy that he loves. <laughs> Okay, so now I'm gonna make some dinner and then I'm gonna prep some taco meat with extra ground turkey because as I said, I like to have food prepped in the fridge that way for lunches if I'm struggling, at least I have that in the fridge. So probably just gonna put some taco seasoning on it and then that's it, it's just already cooked in the fridge and then I can make taco salads or just taco bowls with um, rice. So that's like my go-to for prepping food is taco bowls or salads because it's super easy to do, not many ingredients involved. And I was really busy today, so I wish I had more time to actually prep something. I've been wanting to make like a pasta salad, but maybe I'll do that next weekend. But yeah, just finished dinner and also prepped some food for the rest of the week while we were cooking dinner. So. Like I said, I just did some ground turkey and put a bit of taco seasoning and some red pepper flakes and then had some peppers and onions chopped up to put either on tacos or in a salad and then just have some field greens to make a ta taco salad. So pretty simple, pretty easy. Sometimes meal prep is not always as difficult as people say it is. So it's nice to have something that's like super easy to have and already prepped. So yeah, now I'm just gonna clean up the kitchen, clean the rest of the apartment, and then enjoy the rest of my night. o'clock I have just been working away these past few hours and then got caught up online shopping and thought I would show you guys like what I was looking at I know a lot of you guys asked me like where I get a lot of my activewear from and honestly a lot of it is multiple different brands but right now I'm currently shopping at Aritzia and Revolve so currently in my Aritzia cart I have been really loving this Sunday Best cropped quarter zip. And it's just like a, yeah, tight black jacket. It kind of reminds me of like the Lululemon line, but just cropped and obviously not a full zip. So, in the pricing, $40. And Aritzia's quality of like their workout material is so, so good. So, this I'm really excited to try out. And then I got this cute little pajama set. Um, again, it's their like um, workout material, which is like their uh, TNA Butter Collection. So I just thought that was a cute little set to wear. Then I'm gonna try these Christy pants. I have no idea how they look on, but I really like their track pants. So I thought I would try these out for like casual wear um, when I'm at home or when I'm out and about. And then I loved this tank top. It's just like a cute little lace tank top with this little white bow. I don't know. I thought it was cute for like a casual wear top. But I'm going to order that. Well, all this. And then Revolve. I recently just updated my favorites. So as you guys know, 
I always link my favorites in my IG stories and in the description in my YouTube videos. But I have these jeans, whoopsies, I have these jeans in the black and I wear them all the time. So I thought I would get them in the Charlie Boy color. I'm a size 26. I like them fitting a bit big though, so I could size down, but I like that oversized look. And then in my Revolve favorites, I always try and link this down in my description for you guys, but I try and update it every so often. But I know this is a lot of fashion stuff, but I do actually have some active wear as well because I know you guys like the active wear I wear, but like I've been meaning to buy this green set. I'm literally obsessed with that. And the blue romper, I think rompers will be really, really in this summer for like workout sets or like hot girl walks, all that. I loved this crop sweatshirt tee. Anyways, everything's linked in my favorites, but I do tend to do both like work outfits and fashion fits. I think I'm gonna end this video off here. I'm in my pajamas. I'm literally probably gonna head to bed right after this. So if you guys are new, definitely make sure to subscribe to my channel. A lot of fun content is coming. I yeah, cannot wait to share with you guys some big, big news that I'll be sharing in literally just a few weeks. So definitely make sure to subscribe if you're new. And I love you guys so, so much, and I will see you guys in the next video.